Monster Madness continues. We have a deck of dragons fighting a deck of bigger dragons. It's Baby Dragon versus Chaos Max Blue Eyes. So, let's see how this goes. I'm using one of my favorite Baby Dragon decks. However, with many of the changes in the ban list over the past year, it's not what it once was. And Unfortunately. Chaos Max has, of course, always been a very strong card, but has the potential to brick, so we'll see what this duel comes down to. We'll see who wins the match and moves on to continue in the March Madness bracket. Accept the rules. What kind of hand is this? Welcome to Blue Eyes. <laughs> uh, let's uh, see what I can do. All right, you're making me go first. Uh, that's fine. I'm going to use Sign Up Mining. What do we want to toss out here? Um, I wouldn't mind getting this card into the graveyard. Sure. Dur, 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 dur. Yeah. We're going to put that in the graveyard. We're going to get ourselves a Draco Net. And I guess we'll just normal summon Draco Net to find normal summon to go for. Use that, and we will special summon from the deck this boy right here, Flamvel Guard. We can now go into Crystron Needle Fiber. I'm hoping I have the combo here. I haven't played in a little while. We'll see. Promenesis goes off, Needle Fiber uh, goes off. I feel like that with the amount of the guard dragons you played, I feel like it's going to come back as almost a second nature. Oh, yeah, exactly. So I'm not afraid by any means. Then we'll get this other guard dragon out here. This deck runs a lot of the normal guard dragons because it tries to compound with baby dragon if you haven't seen it in a while. And there's even things that like our normal monster support in here. It's fun. Uh, but yeah, now we can go into some of the standard guard dragon plays. Get ourselves Pisty out here. Get ourselves LP. Excelente. Now we will activate LP. And that will allow us to search from the deck. Nice little red eyes darkness metal dragon. We still have not seen our baby dragon yet, though. So we're gonna have to find him. Is this a. Are you gonna about to go, get into your lockdown field? I mean, it's not as fierce a lockdown anymore when I can't use the agar pain, you know? So we'll see. And yeah. We'll go from the graveyard, you. And then I suppose I still, we'll turn these uh, ones into a nice. consistent without it, at least. Yeah, no, it can still definitely make moves, obviously. It's just not as threatening. There he is. Okay, so we're going to toss away the unexpected die. I don't think I'll need a Dragon Ravine, and I don't need Draco Net anymore. I already used it this turn. So that looks good to me. We will now utilize the Pisty, bringing Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon back from the grave. And we will use Skull Dread's effect. Hmm, do I have any negation plays in this deck? Let's take a look. Um, ooh, I want to try to get that Savage Dragon out if possible, but I think I need certain cards to make that happen. Um, yeah, the other thing about this extra deck, it still has, like, Archfiend Abyss in there, and it's not very likely to be used. So, um, what can I do to get some levels out here on the field? Uh, I just don't really have dragon levels sitting around here, unfortunately. Um, so, unless we do some real crazy shenanigans like so. But I think what we're gonna probably try to do is... Hmm, one level one monster. Yeah, so there's really no point in using this per se. Although... I don't know. That and that are really important to keep, so I may just play a little chill here. We're going to use that and special summon from the graveyard. Um, this one again. Then, what shall I do? Could activate that to summon one of those things, but I kind of need a dragon spare for that. Um, what am I facing again? I'm facing the old Chaos Max, so I can't target you and switch you to defense mode if I go into, like, Boral Sword, for example. Yeah. So we got to be relatively careful. Um, but I don't really have a lot of other great options to combat that. So funny enough, I think we're just going to sit with this field. We're kind of just cultivating a hand, really, with this play. Nothing uh, insane is going on. We're not going to use the other effect of Skull Dread. And... Meaning you're going to try to survive for one turn, so that way you can blow up against me the next. Yeah, I think that's the plan. Solid plan as any. Yeah. Of course, with Chaos Max, there's oftentimes when I can bring out two Chaos Maxes in a turn, but it's not common. Thank you, deck. Oh, trade in, nice. Awesome. Advanced Ritual Art. So we get to see at least one of them. Chaos Max Dragon. Dragon Trine. Sends a, another monster to the graveyard. Mm-hmm. I can send away another Blue Eyes. Yep. And send one more Dragon. And I believe it is the deep of blue eyes you want to send. Yeah, that's always a good little combination. Since okay. You, since you were able to put some blue eyes in the graveyard, it's usable. 
activate this. Nice. Then I'll also have use Return of the Dragon Lords. Actually, I think that's a win for you. Second Return of the Dragon Lords. Oh Lord. boy! Well, that's certainly a win for you. Yeah. They'd be going first uh, with this baby I... dragon style of deck. Isn't the way to do okay, it. Okay, so yeah, but I will say this. I want to, you to imagine a starting hand of two Return but... of the Dragon Lords, two copies of Blue Eyes. And oh no, 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 I had no Blue Eyes. I oh, barely okay. drew that Blue Eyes. If I did oh, draw okay, that Blue so you Eyes, just had the I would have been. And the, uh... But you had the um, Dragon Shrine. Yeah, but if if that was the only card I was able to activate, I would have been in more trouble. <laughs> yeah, bare minimum, you would have been able to put a Blue Eyes to the field. Yeah, of course, a track. The mm -hmm. guard dragon. Yeah, sheer power of that chaos max is what's gonna bring you the victory here. Since I still have Pisty on the field. Alrighty, done. I had to claw her most baby dragon combo in hand. <laughs> oh no, claw Hermos in this kind of deck, in this kind of duel. What do you mean? Oh, the claw Hermos like both dragon decks, so yeah, it's gonna no, it'll be... it'll shred you apart if I get to do it. So. All right, you so you're making first. Eagle yeah. first, right? Because yeah. guard dragons do like going first, but that's like if you're running a deck that plays negation, and this deck doesn't. So not anymore, at least without the uh, with everything nerfed. So let's see, agree the rules, yes, sir. All right, so first off, I'll activate alternative blue eyes. Yeah, don't love this opening hand. Next, I'll activate a trade in, discarding my blue eyes for Very that. Nice. Then I'll activate a Dragon Shrine. All right. I've watched you play this deck quite a few times, Ed. Yeah. Obviously, Some you know what to do. Like... Mm -hmm. I'll send a Deep of Blue Eyes. That can search you the Ritual spell if it is summoned by using Return of the Dragon Lords. Yep. And that only works because you have a Blue Eyes in your graveyard, which obviously you were able to send there. But mm -hmm. two separate cards. Not bad. Activate. Oh, so you're setting up a field. All right. I, I I can't let you I can't let you like have a turn with no yeah. Because if it's an empty field, one. obviously you're dead. So. Yeah. So I kind of have to. Yeah. This is definitely um two very aggressive dragon decks with their offense. It's usually mm -hmm. not how you consider guard dragons, but with this particular nonsense kind of deck with the baby dragon, um, being your MVP. Yeah. Alright, so thing. I'll use these two to go into. Oh no. Okay. Yeah, kind of have to go into this one as an end turn deal. Yeah. <sighs> I'm gonna play and people, and mining people, and, and and um. And people say only Zylo learns from these duels. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. All right, we'll send that to the graveyard. It's not oh, a draw with it to see. I don't know, I man. It's, I might have another spell. Your, your, your call here. Hey, I don't have another spell. <laughs> Darn it! <laughs> <laughs> you tricked me. I did. I had to. All right, we can do that. Then he can bring. Was that? Would that have been really bad? Um, no. I actually had another Draco net in my hand, but now it's just more material to use for other things. Um, yeah. However, you know, it's a two hand with effectively two Draco Nets and two Baby Dragons and a Red Eyes Darkness Battle Dragon who you don't want in a hand. So, yeah. Not much of a choice in the end. Yeah, I'm making the moves I can. Um, this will allow me to get you to the field. Looking and... in this, do you have, like. Oh, you do have Boral Sword, okay. Yeah, of course. So that's a good little plan if nothing else works out now this guy it's only when uh he attacks right let's see da, 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 da. yeah if you declare an attack so i can get over blue eyes chaos dragon yeah i kind of wish i had chaos max but this was the only guy in my hand mm -hmm. and it was either wait for it with him or potentially lose in in an overwhelming field against you on to turn two definitely understandable plays by you um now i got lp and i got a red eyes darkness metal dragon in hand i think what our play is going to be to do this, and then we're gonna special summon. Honestly, I can bring out Destrudo with him, and then just regular summon the Darkness Metal from hand. Um, but Destrudo, no, I'm just going into Skulldred with him anyway, so sure. Alright, then we'll special summon this. Activate that action, and we will special summon from. 
Yeah, probably should go from graveyard because Skull Dread's gonna be able to summon from hand. Okay. We'll bring that out, and that's actually gonna stay on the field because I want to get those three. Oh man, I have so many cards to get off the field. Okay, those three off the field. So let's get Skull Dread moving. Oh no, I wanted to use four. What am I doing? Oh well, I'm done. <laughs> I don't know what I was doing right there. Do this. Oh, I really needed that Skull Dread. What am I thinking? All right, we will go for this boy. He comes out. And then what does this let me activate? We can use Destrudo to come out and play. Um, but what does that leave me with for options? I don't have a lot. Um, so let's see, that already summoned that. Um, I guess we'll just activate this, and that can bring out, um, honestly, just a level 7 of Destrudo, um, which is fine. So we'll go for that, and then, yeah, I can't really go into stuff like Oh, yeah, because they are both tuners, you dummy. All right, <laughs> so, yeah, not the finest of showings for me. We don't have the Oh, combo. right, I should have gone to Galaxy Eyes Photon Lord. That's the one that negates your monster effects. Oh, man. That's um, the one I should have gone into. You know what? We're going to go big gambling out here. Let's do it. Yeah, we'll be fine. Crazy block? Crazy block? <laughs> not that big gamble. Um, oh. <laughs> that's what I was going to say. What should you do level four? Can that? you come back out? No, so... We will actually, since I'd uh, you can just pierce. Well, we don't know what you're going to get. So let's toss these out. And then do some little searches off Skull Dread. But don't need Unexpected Die. I don't hate White Elephant's Gift. I don't need Dragon Trine. Um, I don't mind World Legacy Guard Dragon. But I don't need Drake on it. I love how White Elephant's Gift is one of the older Yugi cards. But now in this kind of deck, it's used more. Yeah. I can actually. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Okay, cool. So now I can freely use World Legacy Guard Dragon. Oh. So you did have enough. Just kidding. Well, I just. You saw me draw them all, boy! I know. I know. <laughs> I wanted to say that just to get you all, to get you a little aggravated. <laughs> yeah. Um, so that'll special summon this boy. And then. We can activate Destrudo. Burn myself a little bit. And unfortunately. We. Oh. I can still what save happened? this. Oh. <laughs> I need to turn him into Link Spire so I can actually just bring out. It's just a portal. I was trying to. Oh, wait, no. Hold on a second. We can get a Savage Dragon out here. Or we could get the uh, Archfiend Abyss out here. Lovely. Okay. Now, Boral Sword Dragon will definitely be able to clear your field and all that right now, but I want to get Savage Dragon. That sounds fun. Oh, wait, can I not? I lied completely, never mind on everything I just said. I clicked the wrong button and thought I could do more than I could. Yeah, so I was dancing around, but I couldn't really get to anywhere, in fact. So, we'll just go to battle. Um, we will attack into you. Rawr. And, Well, yeah. with that kind of big field, I'm surprised to see it end on a Boral Sword. Yeah, just because, you know, once again, this... Oh, no. All right, well, we'll swim. send him to defense mode. And Surprised you didn't just attack him again. Well, I'm more threatened by the Chaos Dragon because he can actually kill. Oh, yeah, true. He does that. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Pope Barbinger for the save. Big save. <laughs> All right. But let's see what I draw. Uh. Yep. Oh, right. I forgot I had the other one in here again. Nice. Uh, unfortunately, I don't think his effect works on you. No, it doesn't. That's why most all I can deal to you is a thousand because I didn't draw oh, yeah, anything else. Not to mention I'm gonna switch you to defense mode right here. Yeah. If I had, if Just I drew a regular target. blue eyes. If I drew a regular blue eyes, I <laughs> would have been able to because I have a alternate, alternate in my hand. Yeah. But I didn't draw it, so that's bad on me. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> We're just gonna battle you, aren't we? Yeah, because I have, like, not enough to really change the game out here. Big risk just doing this, but we gotta. Yeah, wouldn't have had it if I did anything else. So, we'll end the turn right there. My draw? I don't, I did, I wish I had you earlier, Chaos Max. Ah. I really did wish I had you earlier, buddy. <laughs> 
Well, to be fair, at least in how it's gone, uh, there wouldn't have been any difference in how the duel went, but... Yeah, but I would have loved to draw on a... Wait, do I have all three blue eyes in the grave, actually? Um, yeah, I think so. I do, so that was no chance for me drawing a regular blue eyes, actually. Oh, yeah, true. Um, let's see. So, yeah, there's plenty of things we can do, but this is just a straightforward win. And we'll take it. All right, so Borosword just being Borosword won me this one. Unfortunately, that's, you know, if you don't get the full baby dragon combo, it's one of the few things you can do in here. But now you can make me go first. Yeah, so, I can't I can't remember. Was that because you made a slight mistake or? Um, or was it just yeah, like Yeah, because I forgot enough? to, uh, I forgot to select four targets for my original Skull Dread. But even then, it would have just been a luck draw to see if I got my Claw of Hermos or not. Right. All right, Greedy Rules of no more Sure. All right. Oh, boy. What do we actually have to start off with here? Uh, Dragon Trine. Let's send you to the graveyard. And let's send, I suppose... Just your own. No. Yeah, I really got to change the extra deck of this around. But let's see. What can we actually make happen here? We can get Dark Worm out there. Um, and then we can get a second thing out there. And we can get the Needle Fiber play moving. Sure. We'll do that. And then since that happened, we can get Garmonies out onto the field. And now with Garmides there, we can normal summon. Oh wait, why do we need to do Garmides now? Now we can't even bother using the Dark Worm. Oh well, let's normal summon you. And then special summon to bring out. Um, what am I about to click over here? Use your brain, Zylo. Get needle fiber, use your effect. Now we're gonna try to plan, like I know that I can't negate it anymore now, so I'm just gonna try to build a field that can uh, mess with you. So we can use that. Now use Garmides. Ah, darn it. <laughs> Gotta send that boy away. <laughs> um, let's see. Now, if I do that, I can probably get Garmides back out. So, let's see. Oh, no, I can only use that effect once a turn. Am I just done here? <laughs> um, I think I am. So, yikes. Just to come on out. <laughs> Yeah, there's nothing I can do. Um, well, at least you're not ending with a monster in defense mode. Yeah. Alrighty. You know what? We're just going to sit here with the hope and a dream that you have a bad hand. I don't. What? You have blue eyes, man! <laughs> do that. Darn it. And... Yeah, that's alternative right there. Or, or both. It's whatever you want. So you have an alternative and a ritual card in your hand. Yep. You might have two rituals. Oh, man. Yeah, just without the, the same guard dragon freedom. plays being in the game. This deck's just not what it used to be. They're, they're ruining all my fun decks. <laughs> it's as my... if you're playing... It's as if you're playing the meta, and the meta keeps changing on you. Well, that's the thing. None of these are anywhere close to the meta, so. What is, like, the top meta deck right now, actually? I don't know. But I don't think it was Baby Dragon and Exodia. I'll tell you that much. I don't think those two were it. <laughs> All right. What else you got? Oh, is that it? Oh. Yeah, that's it right now. Oh, lovely. If I draw another dragon here, I'm good. If I draw a baby dragon right now, I'm gonna be so happy. Is that the card you need? Yeah. Okay. Do I end it on this? Well, you can't target it. You actually have to overpower No, it. yeah, I can't target Chaos Max, which makes it so much harder, but... Yeah. If I had one more dragon, I would have been able to end with a... with a... with a negate on the field. Uh, yeah. Right, well, I guess we'll put this on the field. I forgot. I just need to have an empty field to play. And then, um, do we dance around it or do we just go for it? Because, yeah. Let's just go for it. We're, it's not going to be Baby Dragon, but... <laughs> it's going to be Supreme King Dark Worm coming in at 8,000 points of damage. Not uh, enough to kill, though. No, not enough to kill. Which is quite unfortunate, but it's what I got, so. If it was Baby Dragon, you'd be dumb for. Obviously gonna go for <laughs> alternative here. Because he could well, drop it right away. But you might just have another alternative in hand. I do. Okay, yeah. So that's a win for you. If Baby Dragon was here, you'd be dead. But. 
And before I forget and do something stupid. Yep. Where's my return of the Dragon Lords when I need it? <laughs> oh, like right here? Oh, boy. <laughs> Very nice. Yeah. Your deck's just definitely got that. I mean, it, it really just right came now. down to, I think it came down to the rock, paper, scissors at the beginning. It might have been, yeah. But then again, this, tur this, this third one was not in your favor, though. Like, in terms of, like, drawings, draws and all that. No, not necessarily. But I also did have to go first and anticipate that kind of thing. Once again, like, if you had that field and I just didn't set oh, out anything, I would be fine right now. This is what I was trying to do. And oh, with this guy. Lord. Okay. Sure. Because uh, when a monster's effect activates its effect, you can detach one material from this card, negate the effect. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you right now. I was like, oh man, I can't target the Chaos Max. I, I, I don't know how I'm I was just playing the whole time. Because <laughs> I knew if either you went for that or Hope Harbinger, I'd be done. Yep. All right, Chaos Max. Moving on, which is what I predicted in my bracket. Unfortunately. Of course you did. <laughs> I know I know the decks we play fairly well. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. It's like I built them or something, you know? <laughs> it's like I know their strengths and weaknesses against each other. But yeah, that is going to be the match. Blue Eyes Chaos Max move on. Next time we are going to bring Ancient Gears versus uh, Ancient Gears versus the Raid Raptors. So we'll see what comes out on top of that. I really do want Ancient Gears to win just to see them versus Chaos Max. They're just crazy beaters against each other. The thing is, the the top card for them is 4,500. Mm -hmm. Top card for this one is 4,000. Yeah, but Ancient Gears are definitely even brickier. So we'll see how it comes down to it. Let us know who you think is going to win in the comments down below. And let us know if you enjoyed this one. Leave a like and we'll see you next time. See you, folks. Oh.